Banya. Want to hear a fractured fairy tale of Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, but now known as the Healing Apple? Here, I, here it goes. In a faraway kingdom, there lived an ugly but nice queen and a pretty but rude princess named Hale Dark. Far away in an orchard, Hale Dark spotted a shiny golden apple. She picked it from the tree and hurried to the castle. When she was inside, she secretly ate the apple, not knowing it was enchanted. She then started feeling dizzy. Thump! She fell straight to the ground. Her father star stared at the floor. He quickly accused the queen. He called the queen and spoke. If you don't heal my daughter in two days' time, I will throw you in the dungeon, he hollered. The queen was startled. What's he talking about, she thought. I didn't do anything. I was bathing in the bathtub. Don't speak nonsense, the king boomed. He slammed the phone on the wall. The queen knew exactly what was going on. She hurried to the orchard. She picked the ugliest apple from the enchanted tree, and she zoomed to the palace. She quickly made a serum in her witch-like bowl. The dwarf saw her and said, It's not a witch-like bowl, it's a cauldron. She chugged half of the serum, leaving half for Hale Dark. She glanced at the mirror. She saw a flawless person. She couldn't believe her eyes. She saw a gorgeous reflection staring back at her. She hurried to the king's castle. She pounded on the door. Open up, I have the cure. The king rushed down the stairs and opened the door. He snatched the serum out of the queen's hands. He was about to close the door when the queen stopped him. Wait, you have to use it in a specific way. You have to pour it on her face and leave it there for an hour. All right, whatever. What's the magic word? Thank you, the king said annoyingly. Now leave. Geez, he woke up on the wrong side of the bed, she mumbled. I heard that. Wait, one more thing, she said mysteriously. The serum is called the healing apple. And just like that, he slammed the door and never... No one ever heard of the queen ever again. Dun, dun, dun. Hope you like my story. Bye for now.